Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. In this video, we will be getting started on yet another machine learning project. So here we are on the UCI machine learning repository website. Let's take a look at the data sets that are available. Go to task and let's pick a classification task this time. And let's take a less number of attributes. So we have Iris, which is the basic machine learning project. Second is rice. Okay. Third is card evaluation. Let's take card evaluation this time. There are six attributes. Data from simple hierarchical decision model. This TV. Maybe you start testing constructive induction and structures coming out of this. Okay. So we have this. We need to do a classification task. There will be categorical attributes. 178 instances and six attributes. Okay. This is the information you can read through it. Attribute information here. So this is the class level that we need to predict. An ACC, ACC good and be good. Okay, so here's the features. The six, one, three, five, six are the attributes, and the final one is the class that we need to predict. Evaluation level, unacceptable, acceptable. Okay, and all of them are categorical variables. Okay, and we are also given some baseline model performance. Awesome. So next, we will go ahead and download the data set. You'll get a zip once you extract it. You will see these three files. First file, as you can see, is contains some info about the dataset, class values, and the attributes. Okay. Next is the data, which I really should contain the data. Let's take a look at the data then. So, if I go here, yes. So the first one is buying, which is B high. I guess very high. Maintenance very high. Dose two. Persons to luggage boot, the size of the luggage boot is small, safety is low, and hence the class becomes unacceptable. So, this is the data set that is given to us. Okay. Next, we have names which should contain info about the data set. Okay, title, sources, past usage, relevant info, crowd, paragraph, number of instances, 178, six attributes, attribute info. There are no missing values again. Class distribution. Okay, so this time we don't have a distributed class balanced distribution we have imbalanced distribution possibly awesome. so this will be the data set that we will be using for the classification task so that's it in the video we'll get started creating the ipython notebook in the next video thank you